Hello, it's Melinda from Alexis and Melinda's Art Space. And just coming on with some more mail. I got lucky, got two parcels today. So this is actually some winnings, and I'll pop her channel down below. It's a fellow Aussie, and she's only got a very little channel. So go over and give her some love. She does some amazing things. Just trying to cut into this, and I should have opened this before I started talking. So she had a giveaway for. Uh, I believe it was some amount of subby she had on her channel. Could have been a bit. Oh, that was very loud. Could have been like 200 or something, and she gave away four different prizes, and my name got pulled. Yay! So I was so happy. So out of the four prizes, my name got pulled for the one I really wanted. I would have appreciated any of her work, and her work is amazing. Oh, a little something for Alexis. So Alexis is in. Ooh. Alexis is in bed, so I'll get her to do that in a separate video. Oops. So I was very excited to win this one. I would have been appreciated to win any one. This is a little Halloween loaded pocket. Oh wow, I love Halloween. It's my favourite time of the year. I got used to... Oh, that's cool. I got very into Halloween when I was in America. I was actually in Canada for... One Halloween, I believe. I believe I was. Um, so this is a loaded envelope, or loaded pocket. Loaded bag, I think they're called. So this is just gorgeous. So it looks like it's been tea or coffee stained. I should tan coffee stain some more things. I just don't drink tea or coffee, so I usually don't have it. I wonder if chocolate would do the same thing <laughs> on Milo. <laughs> That's what I haven't had. A gorgeous paper clip. Another paper clip. I was just admiring this one. It's come on. It's a wooden piece with a pumpkin dressed up as a ch oh, child dressed up as a pumpkin. That's awesome. I can't wait to do a lot of Halloween projects this year. And a bunch of die cuts. Oh wow, so many little die cuts. Frog toes. Alexis will have her eye on some of these. A lot of these things I put on my scanner and actually scan copies of them for Alexis and I to use. I don't think we've got this paper collection. I will have to go and have a look. Costume crazy. Oh, that's cute. Croc tooth. Oh, hairy spider. Spider hair. Oh, hawk claws. Oh, lovely. Oh, I like all the little books. That's cute. And ticket. So these look like they're all... Um, ephemera cutouts from a paper pad. What's this one? Deep into the darkness, peering long, I stood there, wondering, fearing. I love the little flags. Aren't the flags cute? Oh, lovely. They are going to go awesome. And I'll definitely probably be scanning those, just so I can hoard them as well as use them in the back of the pocket. Oh, there's something still down. Do I want to stick my hand in? Really? Oh, some little wood veneers. I'm thinking, do I want to stick my hand in a Halloween pocket? Something else in there. So if you don't know what a um, bag flip is, this is actually like a lunch bag. And it's the one that has the gusset, as you can see the gusset in the side. And it looks like Susan, the lovely lady that's made this, has just folded up the bottom to make the pocket. And that is awesome. I'm going to have to make, I'm going to make myself a Halloween junkie journal this year. I think, oh sorry about that. And I'm going to put your pocket in it and a bunch of this stuff as well. Oh, some little wood veneers. I don't actually have any wood veneers, I don't think. I love the glasses. I wear glasses, so I'm going to use that in my layout. And the car and the bike. don't know what I'll do with the car because I don't actually drive. I'm not allowed to drive due to low vision, which didn't really bother me until I had a daughter and now it just annoys the pip out of me that I can't drive anywhere. But we walk. Oh, some index cards and some border strips. Ooh, some more lovely die cuts. Flea legs. Oh, chicken toes. Oh, I love the paper on the back too. Isn't that awesome? Oh, some more cutouts. Greetings from Halloween. Oh, these are definitely going to go on my scanner so I can use them. Come over on Halloween with appetite keen for food and fun. Oh, wow. I wonder what paper collection this is from. They look like they're all from the same one. Oh, this is cool. That's cool. Love the old film strip. Halloween tag. 
We're actually, Alexis and I are going down to Melbourne for a Halloween event this year. They've got one at St Kilda Town Hall, so we're going to head down there and have a look. Last year we were in Halloween, we are in Sydney. We went to Luna Park, that was awesome. Oh, that's pretty with the clocks. Love that paper. That's cute. More Halloweeny stuff. Not usually into a whole load of vintage, but I do love vintage Halloween. I use a lot. I don't really have five things. That's cute. Project Lifestyle card. I, I will use everything, but I like a lot more of these are sort of my colours, the more bright ones, but I do love Halloween vintage stuff. And I'm getting old typewriter. I'm getting into using a bit of vintage stuff as well. It's like an old index card. Rolodex card. Oh, that was it because I went through those before. So thank you so much. I will tack on to this Alexis going through her bag of goodies. She loves die cuts and bits and pieces so she's going to have awesome fun in here. I'm trying to take a peek but I better not open it because she'll... I will get in trouble. Ooh, that one looks interesting. I wonder what that one is. No, I'm going to stop looking because she'll, she'll know I've opened it. So I'll take another video on and you'll see Alexis going through her bag of die cuts. I can see a t-shirt. Um, and she's going to love using all those. I wonder if I can pinch a couple. I wonder if she'll let me. We usually share everything anyway. Um, so thank you so much Suzanne and I'll pop a link to her channel below. Go and give her some love because she's a very new young uh, Aussie channel. And she does a lot of junk journals and a lot of um, stuff. And her, her stuff is amazing because she just has this knack of putting stuff together in her junk journals that just looks fantastic. Sometimes I go to do a junk journal and do put a whole lot of different pages together but I just can't get them to go together and look as if they go together and she just has that simple knack of doing that. So I will leave you there. Bye. Hello, it's Melinda back from Alexis and Melinda's Art Space. Oh, sorry, wrong way, wrong way. Just wanted to come back and share the little something that um, Susan put in the bag for Alexis. And I showed this to Alexis tonight and she said I could share it on camera. And open it. She's gone to bed early. She's very tired tonight. Oops. Sorry for the noise. And I'm going to see if I can put... Oh wow, this is a bag full of goodies. And I don't know whether I'm going to put everything out. A stack of teacups out of pattern paper. So there's some little loads of die cuts. There's little um, enamel, like enamel stickers with pictures under them. I'm just going to quickly go through them. Oh, I love the globe. That's awesome. Oh, that's like done out of book paper or something. That's cool. And a cow. You have some awesome dyes. Oh, I love the cups. And a, oh, a leaf and a butterfly. You have some awesome dyes. Oh, another world. That's really cool. Oh, I'm trying to take the thing off the top. I thought it was on the top, but it's not. That's really awesome. I love the world dye. That's cute. Some more little birdie. Some out of glitter, which is really cool. Oh, I like the girl too. Isn't the girl pretty? Oh, another girl. Look at the girl on the t-shirt. I'm going to have to build up our dye collection. I just bought a bunch of Halloween ones. and Oh, the little mason jar. We've got that one. Um, and we're going to have to get some more because they're so much fun to use. What else have we got? Oh, a t-shirt. Some birds out of book paper, t-shirt out of, looks like a Christmas card. That's a clever idea, kind of out of Christmas cards. And some homemade embellishments. Oh, there goes my phone every time I turn it on. Lex is going to have so much fun making some stuff out of here. Thank you for all of this, Susan. She will love it. Oh, some mason jars with a butterfly cut out of it. She loves sticking things like this down. Oh, some people. Some little girl dolls. They're cute. And a, oh, she's pretty. More mason jars, more flowers, some butterflies put together. I love this kind of shiny paper. That's cool. Oh, another lady. Out of an old Christmas card. Oh, and a cow. Isn't the cow gorgeous? Ornament and a bird. Another cow. Oh, I like the spiral. Isn't that cool? What's this one? Oh, that's an ornament. 
Christmas ornament. That is pretty. You could either do that either way. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, and some scallopy rings. Is that one of the ones that folds up to be a flower? I'll have to have a go at that. Oh, I love the peacock. I've um denied about getting the peacock dye. That one might have to go into my stash. Well, she knows the peacock missing. She probably will. Oh, another cow. And some butterflies. I love how you're cutting them out of old cards. That's really cool. Oh, is that a folded butterfly? Oh, it is too. That's a clever idea. And some little tags with hearts. They're cute too. And teddy bear. Thank you so much, Susan, for all these goodies. Alexis will love putting some of these on cards. And we can paint some of these and do all sorts of fun stuff with them. So I just wanted to share that. Thank you.